Pre conference is a meeting to elicit um, the um, concerns of stakeholders on the issues of inequality in Nigeria, especially with regard to um, extractives um, in the country. Uh, this is towards a larger meeting of um, issues of inequality and extractives in West Africa. As you know, that um, Nigeria is one of the richest one of the resource richest resource countries in the world, and yet that uh, our poverty levels are extremely high, that it's not translating to wealth for citizens. And the gap, the, in, the, the, the inequality gaps are just too wide. Uh, this conference is seeking to address those issues um, primarily. Some of the issues that have been identified, of course, are the mismanagement of natural resources, um, conflicting policies of, uh, by government, um, the failure to look at the impact of climate change on natural resource governance, um, state capture um, continues, state capture, impunity and corruption continue to be a resounding theme around these issues. Um, and, and, and so that we also just need to look at these issues and, and, and think about how to deal um, with these issues um, effectively. We need a people-centered governance of natural resources. That's where to start from. That we must put power back in the hands of ordinary people in West Africa, in Nigeria, to determine how those resources, whether they should be honest or not, and that if they are, we must, we must be able to put enough power in the hands of people to make informed decisions about it. Democracy is not just about electing people into offices, but also about people choosing what happens with their resources, natural resources being one of them, ensuring that um, people are able to take the information they have, make the right decision that ensures that the, even the poorest amongst us are able to, that the poorest amongst us are able to harness um, the benefits of the natural resources that our country offers. There are a number of them, one of them is agriculture and that we must look at tapping into the natural resources that agriculture affords us. The other are solid minerals. Um, we are coming to the end of oil very soon. Nigeria also needs to begin to think about the end of oil and what will happen with our solid minerals. So we have such a lot of solid minerals across the country, gold, sapphire, um, and, and we must think about which one of them are ready to be honest and which ones we should leave in the soil. Nigeria is not at a very good place right now, as you know, and I think that we're all looking for solutions. I think that um, rubber having met the road, that um, we're all confronted with, our, with how fragile we've become, that should drive political will. If we still do not have political will at this point to implement, then the prognosis is very dire.